Hey guys, it's me, Colors for Hamsters, and today's video is going to be Bagel's Cage Tour. I also realized I never, ever did a cage tour on Bagel's Cage before, um, except for the video, this very, very short video on introducing Bagel. But I could say that wasn't even really a proper cage tour, so I'm, I'm doing my very first Bagel Cage Tour. So... Um, if you're curious, I got Bagel in January 19th, so pr pretty long time back, and I can't believe I still haven't done a cage tour yet. But guess what? It's here, so enjoy. So first, to open the cage, you can open these two flaps, and there's two on every end. This is an overview of the cage. I also cleaned Bagel's cage yesterday. Um, it looks a bit messy, but I did clean Bagel's cage yesterday. So first I'll start off on the bottom layer. So first he has his little puzzle playground, and I'm not even sure if he's sleeping in it because he sleeps in it sometimes, he sometimes doesn't, so I'm not positive if he sleeps in it, and I just made it into like a little house or a hut for him. Then over here he has his living world bendable bridge um, tree house and he sometimes like to go through it and as you can tell it's made out of natural wood which is absolutely safe and they're like about $3.99 at pet stores which is really cheap for a natural chew or toy so I really do recommend these these logs or bendable bridges. Then back over here he has a little veggie dish but there's nothing inside because I only feed him veggies on Tuesdays and also peanut so yeah. Then on the bottom I have a little puzzle playground stand sort of like a stand um, and I placed his food dish on top and do not worry peanut Bagel can reach up to here. I saw him before, so do not be like, oh no, Bagel can't reach his food. He can because I saw him before, so do not worry. And what's inside the food is some hazel hamster, some living world pellets, living world green pellets, some science selective pellets, and um, what's it called? Vitacraft, Vita Smart hamster food. So that's what's inside his food. Oh yeah, and the food dish. I got it from PetSmart for around $2.99. Then as you can see, he has his KT water bottle right here. Um, he, it has like a little duck, if you can see. And it's on the back of the cage, so I cannot show you guys. But it's really cute. And I also have this wire um, thing to attach the water bottle to the cage. So... Um, yeah. And if you are curious why I have a woman play mat down there is because, well, the basic reason why is because, so, like, when the water drops down, um, if it ever drips or leaks or something with the water bottle, I know that it won't go on the bedding, so I placed a woven play mat there, so it'll sort of, like, I guess you could say absorbs, um, the water and I do not have a rock for bagels so far, but I'm looking for one, so then I can take the woven play mat and use it as a chew for bagel. And as you can see, back over in this section, I have a whole bunch of chews. He has this watermelon chew. Um, I don't even know why, but two of these nibbler balls. A lot of these, like, sticks. Um... You know, not Nibbler, a red star chew, um, a present, an apple, this is from Ecotrician, and yeah, that's basically what's in there, in the chew section, <laughs> okay, so yeah, that's just the chew section. Then we have his red silent spinner but at night it's actually not silent so i might change his wheel or um i might do something maybe like to change the wheel um so it'll go like not as loud because at night it's so loud um 
and also bagel and also bagels and peanuts so yeah i just have that from PetSmart. okay then we have this all living things um puzzle you know bungalow or something i totally forgot what it forget what it's called so um yeah i just got it from PetSmart, and it's like well bagel can just like um go up here jump in here go down there so it's basically like a really really fun toy for bagel he also has his little nest in here so here's just some um care fresh crinkles i got no wait care fresh nestables and i have some paper shavings so i just have that and as you can see down over there there's one paper towel roll and I'm really sorry if you can't see it because, um, well, it's really back down there and then there's this wood that that's covering it. So, um, you can't see it, but if you can, this is what it looks like. And Bagel sometimes likes to chew it and he likes to run through it and yeah. Then there is the top level. So this is just a quick overview of what it looks like. So first he has his carrot nibbler chew from Wacky Rabbit. So I got that, and then he has this little mineral um, chew, and it's an 8 inch. None of my hamsters really like mineral chews, but I just keep it in here just in case if they would like to nibble on it. Then he has his little cheese hut, and it can expand. So um, this is just what it looks like, and I got it from... Uh, what's it called? Bobby's Bun Boutique, if you're wondering. And it does ship to Canada and the United States. And the good thing about Bobby's Bun Boutique is that it has UK stuff. So you can order it from UK and it will ship to Canada or United States. Then we have this little crinkle tunnel. And it's purple and blue. I got that from Viovet. And Bagel really loves it. As you can see, he sometimes like runs it, runs through it. And he sometimes play in it. And he sometimes even sleep in it, so pretty surprisingly, but he does. So thanks for watching Bagel's Cage Tour for April, and I know it's almost the end of April, so I thought I should better t um, get this video out of here. And as you can see, Bagel's sleeping down over there. He's so cute. So thanks for watching. Bye!